Hello everybody, Spooky Season here and welcome back to another Military Tycoon video and today we're going to be doing a little bit of a shorter video, we don't have a lot to talk about today, but we're going to be talking about some all new leaks regarding um, tanks and Military Tycoon and some changes coming to how they fight their little combat, well not really how they fight, but some changes coming to their physical design, like how they shoot their gun, how the um, am ammunition look, it's pretty interesting, I'm excited to see it, it just adds a little bit of realism to Military Tycoon and makes the game feel a little bit more fun. As always, I'll be giving away 10,000 robux at 30,000 subscribers so if you want to contribute to that just subscribe and you'll be able to help out and without further ado let's get into it so today we, we received some new leaks regarding um tanks and military tycoons specifically for the leopard 2 we don't truly know if this is coming to other tanks either now or anytime soon but basically i'll put a gif of it on screen the first thing i'll cover is the new tank shells coming to the game so currently i'll show you guys what um, a tank firing firing looks like right now we just fly over so right now, let me find the leopard. When a tank fires, it shoots this weird little undetailed blob. Watch, I'll shoot into the ocean and make it more clear. It shoots like a rectangle, a yellow rectangle. Let me try to get it again. I'll add like a freeze frame of it on screen so you guys can see it easier. I'm sure you guys caught like a glimpse of it right there anyways. But right now, tanks in Military Tycoon, they just shoot out like a solid um, rectangle. It's not detailed. It looks kind of funky. I mean, it does the job, right? But it could look a lot better. But soon, a new tank shell design is coming to Military Tycoon, and I'll put a gif of that on screen right now. Obviously, it's an actual tank shell instead of, you know, a yellow rectangle in Military Tycoon. Um... I really like this design. It makes it look. A it makes the game feel a lot better, like more realistic. It doesn't really change combat itself at all. Like it doesn't add anything in terms of just fighting, but it makes the game look a lot cooler in my opinion. It adds just a new like detail. It adds basically a quality of life feature almost something that really isn't necessary, but just makes the game feel a lot better. It's a trend. I'm excited to start. Like I'm excited that I'm now seeing among Military Tycoon where they actually put effort into content or they actually put effort into things that really aren't like game changing, but just improve the look of the game, right? I mean they don't have to add tank shells but it just makes the game look a lot cooler doesn't it and let's move on to the next thing we're going to talk about today for tanks and that is an all new design for tank firing or not, not really an all new design what i mean is they're adding recoil for the turret on the tank for the cannon on the tank so right now watch the tank right here as you can see when i fire nothing pushes back there's no recoil on the tank gun itself so it just looks like nothing happened right <laughs> i just destroyed that tank but it looks like nothing happened right you just fire a shot and nothing happens like what i mean by nothing happens is that there's no visible effect on the tank itself well, the developers are changing that i'll put the gif of it on screen right now and that is right the developers are changing or not changing they are adding tank recoil to military tycoon once again this is another quality of life feature something that isn't game changing but it's still really nice to see this won't be like a major update or anything but it's just something cool no we like likely added along with another update tanks in military tycoon are really underappreciated they feel like the worst combat platform honestly in terms of boats ships and planes tanks are the worst in game so it really is nice to see love given to the tanks even if it's not something ma super major because i really want like more ground focused combat in military tycoon it'd be super fun we've seen the developers say before that they're gonna focus on ground combat more which i'm not sure if they're gonna actually hold up to that if they'll actually like focus on ground combat a little bit more but i'd love to see it and this is a step in the right direction for just ground combat in general just adding something really nice like this oh actually um update i wasn't recording or but when i finished recording this video this leak wasn't out but there's an, uh, another leak for um tanks and military tycoon they're adding an all new crosshair for the tank cannon. Oh, actually, um, update. I wasn't recording, or, but when I finished recording this video, this leak wasn't out, but there's an, uh, another leak for, um, tanks and military tycoon. They're adding an all new crosshair for the tank cannon. So you guys know how, um, let, let me pull it up real quick. Where is it at? I'll just pull out the, I'll pull out the, um, the frigate. So you guys know how, um, boats got this all new little cannon thing right you can see that little x there that shows you where, where you're aiming that's a pretty cool feature well tanks are getting something similar i'll put the gif of it on screen right now but tanks are getting an all new cannon system it seems well not cannon system you know what i mean crosshair aiming system whatever i'm looking at the leak on my phone right now so there seems to be a big white box why am i still drowning all right there we go there seems to be a big white box as well as a smaller box that um, goes inside of it. It's either red or green or red if you're not aiming correctly and green if you are. I don't know how this will work, honestly. Why did my game just color shift to be darker? Huh. <laughs> Is it I almost drowned? So it'll work a lot like how the boat crosshair works. I assume like if you're aiming at something, it'll show you if your target is actually ready to hit. 
I'm excited to see this, obviously. I love to see more love for tanks in Military Tycoon. As I already mentioned earlier, it's just nice to see stuff added to ground vehicles when the game is so focused on air in general. It feels like they're finally starting to listen to what we want, doesn't it? Yeah. But that's still all I have to add. Nothing else really major going on. Of course, I'll say it again. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time.